Just when Kylie Jenner comes out of hiding, she might want to go back in because reports are saying that Mama Chris is teaming up with Tyga behind Kylie's back. Oh my gosh, what? And Kendall Jenner and Gigi Hadid are apparently threatened by model newcomer Kaya Gerber. I believe it, but this is something I'm not sure I believe. Cardi B is reportedly the next celeb to have a bun in the oven. That's crazy. We're talking about all of these things right now on Holly Scoop's Moments of the Week. Happy weekend, you guys. Welcome to Holly Scoop's Moments of the Week. I'm Madison Hill. And I'm Devin Howard. We're kicking things off with Miss Kaya Gerber. Okay, so the modeling industry, as everyone knows, it's kind of a tough one. You always hear how it's hard for newcomers to break in mm -hmm. and gain the respect of veteran models. I know Kendall Jenner has had that problem. Right. Several people, Gigi and Bella, because their mom was also a model. So people were like, oh, this has just been handed to you. Right. Um. So this is most likely also due to the fact that Older models are always threatened by the younger right. ones who are coming in. So mm -hmm. similar to how Kendall and Gigi potentially feel threatened by newcomer Kaya Gerber. Oh, I know. Weird. Well, the girl has been taking the fashion world by storm. She's only 16 and she's walked in practically every major fashion show from Paris to Milan. Obviously, New York Fashion Week. Um, this week, she even walked alongside the Hadid sisters in the Anna Sui show. I mean, she is everywhere that sometimes I forget she's only 16. Yeah, she, I mean, she looks older than 16, mm -hmm. she acts older than 16, and she's had the success of somebody who's been in the industry for a very long time. Right, and obviously, I mean, she gets it from her mom. Her right. mom is renowned supermodel Cindy Crawford, but I can see why Kendall and Gigi would be a bit worried. I mean, don't you, she's kind of like, everyone used to talk about them the way they're talking about Kaya Gerber. I, but I still feel like people are talking about mm -hmm. Gigi and Kendall and Bella all like this. And I wish that it wasn't like a, ooh, we're threatened by another woman. Like, I wish they could all be friends. Right. <laughs> well, and that's what it appears is going on. There's been several pictures that have been taken during New York Fashion Week that show them embracing the new model. So I like to think that I'm with you, that hopefully they're kind of taking her under their wing because they know what it's like to be thrust into the spotlight. Right. I mean, obviously they all come from pre-established families, like we were saying, Kendall, obviously, the Car Jenners, mm -hmm. the Hadids, their mom was a model, Kaya, her mom was a model. So I think they definitely have that in common. So I hope that instead of being like, let's not let Kaya have success that they're like let's help her so we can all be successful exactly and that's i think a good lesson for everybody i agree help each other be friends with the people who are in your industry like that's how you guys all end up happy in the end yes so devin and i have had this conversation so many times yes um so we're thinking that their friendship is genuine yes because we're being we're positive 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 okay <laughs> next we are going to talk about kylie jenner she was spotted out for the first time post Stormy out in Calabasas with Jordan Woods. Exciting. She already looked like she was getting her pre baby bod back. She was like in all black. She had a fanny pack. She looked great. Mm -hmm. um, but the big thing is, this appearance came at a time when rumors were swirling that Kris Jenner is teaming up with Tyga to get Kylie to conduct a paternity test to see who Stormy's dad is. That is. So bizarre. So absurd. No, it gets even <laughs> worse. A source told Hollywood Live, quote, Chris has started saying she thinks that there's a chance the baby could actually be Tyga's. Kylie swears up and down it's not possible, but Chris is still hoping. She's scheming with Tyga to do a paternity test behind Kylie's back. No way. I feel like, what? What mother would do this? Who would scheme with uh, the ex-boyfriend? Chris Jenner? <laughs> Are you serious? I, I think that... Chris always has, she is a good mom, obviously she wants all of her kids to succeed, but I think she does always have her own agenda. But I just think it's interesting that she's siding with Tyga and trying to push Travis Scott out of the picture. Right. And what's even more interesting, that regardless of who the father is, she wants Tyga to be the one who ends up with Kylie. Um, the source went on to tell Hollywood Life, quote, Tyga thinks it could be his baby and Chris very much wants that to be true. But even if Tyga's not the baby's biological father, he may end up stepping in. At least that's what Chris would like. Okay, that is so strange to me because as we saw in that baby announcement video, Travis was there for everything. Mm -hmm. I mean, he was there so much more than any of us ever thought he was. So the fact that Chris is hoping that Tyga's able to insert himself into this new family dynamic is very odd. I know, I was really upset about this because I am so team Travis Scott now. It's Me not too. even funny. And so I'm just like, Chris, you've got to look at the bigger picture and see who is there for your daughter. Who's the better choice? And I think right now it's Travis Scott. Right. So she just needs to, they both just need to like 
let that new family unit be a family unit. Yeah, like let them just chill and enjoy each other's company in the early new stages of parenthood. I know. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Okay, you guys, last but not least, another celebrity who might be taking some tips from Kylie Jenner on how to hide her pregnancy is Cardi B because TMZ reported this week that Cardi B is pregnant. Apparently, her team let the news slip during the Maxim Super Bowl party. Yikes, Cardi performed, and then after, um, a party staffer asked someone from Cardi's entourage if they could escort her to get an ice cold alcoholic beverage. I mean, I think it's pretty obvious Cardi B seems like one who like wants to celebrate, oh, yes. always have fun. For sure. But sources told TMZ that the member of Cardi's team shut it down real quick and revealed that Cardi didn't want to be in a quote party atmosphere because she's three to four months pregnant. Apparently she just like sipped on Fiji water the whole time. That's I, I don't even know what to think of this. She definitely could be pregnant, which mm -hmm. is maybe why she's trying to make things work right. out with Offset so much, but I don't know. I know, and I'm just kind of confused why someone from her team would let that slip. Like, hello, PR 101. Yeah. If your celebrity is pregnant, you keep it locked down until you know for sure and she's ready to announce it to the public. But right. yeah, like you said, she's been combating pregnancy rumors for a while now. Um, a few weeks ago, remember she had that epic comeback saying, quote, let me fat in peace, which Love I was that. like, yes, girl, same. <laughs> and then it, I, there is a little evidence, kind of like what you were saying. So right. during New York Fashion Week, Cardi was seen pulling a Khloe Kardashian and wearing a trench coat. And obviously, Khloe knows what to wear to hide a belly. Oh, yes. The girl did it for a long time. Mm -hmm. And then she also wore this green suit with a perfectly placed white fur shawl. Like, it's perfectly over her belly in every picture when she's sitting, standing, talking. It's pretty crazy. Huh. I don't know what to think. I really don't know. I don't really feel like I have a major opinion either way. I mean, mm -hmm. she definitely could be pregnant. It, I could see it happening, but also she's been so staunchly denying those rumors. I know. Let me fat in peace. I mean, like it would be one thing if she didn't acknowledge them at all. Right. But she's actually saying like, you guys, I'm just getting no, fat. No, you're right. And even <laughs> at the Grammy, she said, she addressed it too. She's like, everyone's always asked me if I'm pregnant. Like if I was, I would tell you. Right. So I'm just like, I don't know what to believe. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I'm like selfishly don't want her to be because I love Cardi B and I just want her to keep making more music. Well, maybe she'll still make music. Well, I know, Even but you know, but I'm like, we don't need, we don't have time for a maternity leave, Cardi. We need music <laughs> constantly and we need it now. All right, you guys, let us know what you think about all of these stories. Do you think Cardi B is actually pregnant or not? We don't know. I can't wait to find out. Um, what do you think about Kris Jenner supposedly teaming up with Tyga behind Kylie's back? Crazy. Oh, I hope that's not true. And last but not least, do you think Kendall and Gigi are threatened by Kaya Gerber, or do you think they're actually all just friends? Talk it out down there in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you here next week at Holly Scoop. Bye, guys. Have a good weekend.